What's going on guys? Coming to you with another tool review today here. Uh, this is gonna be on a Tack Life cordless screwdriver. Um, I'm pretty a fan of Tack Life tools. Uh, I have to say, I like their stuff. Uh, this is something new that they've come out with here. And we're gonna dive into it and see what we've got. First off the bat, we're gonna get a little tray here that's got 0, 0, 0, 1, 2, 3, and then 3, 4, 5, 6 flats, and a driver. So this is going to have pretty much everything in it that you're going to need for around the house. Uh, Phillips and flathead. Uh, it's not going to have any Torx bits or anything like that in it. You would need to do those separate. But for everyday household use, this is ideal. USB charger. Micro USB charges this unit up. You don't need a separate battery. You don't need a separate charger. Um, you can pretty much just plug this right into the bottom. Plug this into one of your USB outlets or plug it into a computer and it should charge up and do great. Uh, we've got forward. Oh, it's even got a little light on the end here. Um, got reverse. And then it locks in place if you put it in between the two. So that is gonna be our little Tack Life screwdriver here. We got our user manual here. They call this a cordless screwdriver. Um, and always remember with Tack Life tools, you can get an extra warranty. You just have to go on and register those. I highly recommend doing that on any tool. Uh, it's really good if you register your tools. Now we've got uh, English, Dutch, French, Spanish, Italian, and I'm assuming Chinese. I can't read Chinese, so uh, they go pretty in depth here. You got safety information for the chargers. Uh, it tells you if you're gonna have it serviced, it needs to be by a qualified repair person. Usually you can contact Tack Life and they'll set you up and uh, take good care of you. Now, going through the specs here, the chuck size on this is quarter inch. So that's pretty standard. Any of the driver tools and stuff that you buy, whether online or at the box stores or anything, is gonna fit in here. So if you needed something special like a Torx driver, um, a nut driver or something to that extent, you could pick one of those up and this will accept it. Uh, it'll only do about 40 inch pounds of torque, so it's not super powerful, uh, but it has a 1500 milliamp hour battery. Uh, charging time takes about three hours. It's 3.6 volts and it is a lithium ion battery and it only takes uh, five volt charger, uh, two amps or less in order to charge through here. So that works out pretty good. Like I said, this is a pretty handy little thing. Uh, as small as it is, you can stick it in a drawer uh, along with this kit here and pretty much do anything around the house. Hang a picture, uh, fix a loose screw on a cabinet door, something to that extent. But what we're actually gonna do is I'm gonna take out the PH2 Phillips bit here. We'll see how that sets in there. Oh, it's magnetic too, guys. So, I mean, once you put it in there, it is uh, boom, locked in. It's not gonna fall out. That's awesome because I lose these things like crazy. Uh, and what I've done is I brought a piece of wood in here and I've got three different screws here. Uh, I've got this big fat one, I've got a drywall style screw, and then a just a standard wood screw. Now, what we're gonna do first is I'm just gonna take this, we're gonna put it on forward, set it on here, and we're gonna screw this into this piece of wood. Now, it went so far and it stopped. We're gonna back off here. That's pretty much it. It pretty much sunk that one in. Now we're gonna run the drywall screw in and the difference between the two is this one was coarse thread and this one's kind of fine thread. So we're just gonna run this one in. There we go. It flushed that one in. Once it reaches a certain torque point, it stops uh, simply because I don't think they wanna burn the motor up in it. Uh, that's two of the smaller screws. This is the bigger one of the three. I imagine it may have a little bit of trouble with this one, uh, given the fact that it is the size that it is, and we don't have a hole pre-drilled. If I was gonna do this normally, I would just pre-drill a hole. So 
So we got so far, you can hear the wood cracking. So this is a big screw going into here, but still yet it drove it in that far. And I think I can pretty much, no, that's about as far as it's gonna go uh, on that big screw there. But still the fact that this little bitty drill right here put that, I mean, my impact driver has trouble putting these in without a pilot hole. So that says a lot and it's 18 volts. Um, this little 3.6 volt screwdriver drove that right in there and uh, you got a little indicator on top. That's your battery charger. You can see it light up here when we start using it. Um, like I said, it takes about three hours to charge this. I did pull it out and pre-charge it prior to doing the review just to make sure that it was fully charged. I uh, didn't want to start it with a weak battery or something to that extent. Always, anytime you have a rechargeable tool, make sure you fully charge it before it's first use. Uh, now we'll put this thing in reverse and we'll see how we do here. Took the big screw out. Took the drywall. And took the wood screw out. So guys, listen, if you're looking for a little screwdriver electric to pop in the drawer, fix little things. Uh, tighten up a loose door handle, tighten up a loose cabinet handle, hang a picture, um, assemble a piece of furniture, something to that extent that you got from one of the box stores or from the furniture place. This thing's ideal. Tack Life stands behind their tools. It's pretty rugged feeling. I like the rubber grip on it. Uh, the plastic housing doesn't feel real flimsy. Like I can't sit here and twist it and feel like it's just going to crumble in my hands. So it does seem to be a pretty quality tool. Time will tell once we use this some more, but um, as far as just using it around the house every day, it should hold up and do just fine. Keep it charged and in the drawer and it's ready to go. Guys, listen, I appreciate y'all tuning in. Again, this is the Tack Life cordless screwdriver. I'll put a link to it down in the description. Uh, be sure, give us a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, drop comments or questions down below, and as always, stick with us because we're going to be coming to you.